everyone welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel depending on if you're a first-time viewer or a subscriber I don't know um <laughs> welcome back and um, in this video I will be exposing guys mm -mm -mm. Hmm. Um, and this is not to all guys I understand that there's like 1% of you that's like really good but like the other like 99 I don't know what's going on with you um so and this is not just guys some girls do do, do do this too but I am speaking from a girl's perspective talking about a guy because that's what I do okay so I had gone through a situation earlier this year where I was putting in so much effort and I was putting in my feelings and I was putting in like so much I guess of me into this situation knowing the outcome I kind of already knew that this situation was not going to work out that this was just kind of a lesson to be learned and um and it was kind of like a karma in a way like for me but we're not gonna get into that so anyways but I still wanted to give it a chance I was just like you know what like let's just give it a chance you know I like to play with fire because I'd be feeling all dangerous okay and whatnot so um yeah so um I always give the benefit of the doubt that is something you guys always have to know about me I will always give you the benefit of the doubt until like you know until you mess up and then that's that's on you not me okay um but that's the thing so I just I don't know I always feel like I let myself down because like I know that I could have done better and like I didn't like I didn't do better like you know it's just like damn like dude like I could have freaking like, I didn't have to go through all this to like realize like what's right from what's wrong like you know so um in this situation so I had met this guy and we hit it off and there was like oh whole bunch of chemistry okay but not the like the good kind of chemistry like you know uh, well I guess it is good to some people but anyways that's not the point the point is is that he would text me so we started off we met each other in school and whatever and like we started off and right off the bat like we were just so into each other right this guy texted me literally for two weeks straight he texted me good morning like I hope you have a good day like I hope you um like slept good and like all that mushy stuff like you know and for two weeks straight I was just like oh, okay cool like this dude seems like he's interested in me after those two weeks he never texted me good morning after that so I kind of like the first day that I didn't receive the text message I was just kind of like okay like maybe he's still sleeping maybe his, he didn't charge his phone maybe like you know just I don't know like I just wasn't thinking like whatever but then I kind of thought about it I was like maybe he did lose feelings but it's cool because you know it's okay so anyways so then after that but he still texted me like throughout the day like he would still text me as if like nothing happened so I'm like okay maybe this dude kind of like backed off a little bit whatever the case may be so the part of like exposing the guy or exposing guys is they're gonna get you on a routine they're gonna make you feel like like you're gonna start expecting text messages and that's not to say that you cannot text them first because girls like look you can let him know that he's the first thought that you thought of after you peed this morning okay like that there's nothing wrong with it okay but um, my whole thing is guys get you on this routine of like at least what I've been through they get you on this routine where they make you feel comfortable you know like you video chat with them and they're like you look so beautiful without makeup and that is true like look none of us girls don't need to be putting on like thousands of pounds of makeup on okay to look good like we all look good okay honey but when you're a little crush says it it makes you feel like so freaking good because you're just like oh, he thinks I'm so beautiful without my makeup like <laughs> okay but that's not the point the point is is that they get you on this routine like they get it kind of like trained in your head of like now you expect me to text you every morning and when I don't that's when they reel you in because now you're texting him and as soon as you text him he already knows he's already like boom like I already got the girl like my my work here is done like my two weeks I'm good. So basically, he like just put in his two-week notice and now he's out the door, okay? Because he's like, she's gonna follow me, like, you know? And this is not all girls. This is some girls. Because I know some girls, like, they don't put up with this. Like, look, homeboy, if you don't, um, if, like, you don't, like, do what you did in the beginning, I'm gonna cut you off, okay? And, and that's the thing. And I feel like a lot of girls are like, well... It, you know like yeah I get the whole he's busy and I'm busy kind of thing but you're gonna make time for your priorities you're gonna make time for people who make time for you and who want to see you and who who want to chill with you and what whatnot like you know what I'm saying but 
the basic point in this is guys are going to put you on a routine. Guys are going to make you feel comfortable, which there's nothing wrong with that. They're going to make you feel like you're on top of the world and you can tell me anything, baby girl. Like, I'm here forever, blah, blah, blah. What do you know damn right? Like, you already got your mind on, like, someone else. Like, oh, I don't know. And whoever's going to be like, damn, who hurt you? A lot of people, okay? <laughs> That's why I'm making this video. Um... But that's the thing, and again, it's not only guys, because girls do this too, like, I feel like it's, it's like 50-50, really, like, you know what I'm saying, like, I'm not one of those girls that play you, like, I just, I, that's, that's just not me, but like, you know, from what I've been through, I'm just letting you guys know that, you know, people gonna get exposed. Okay, so um, I kind of hope this video helped in a way, I don't know if it did, I, I highly doubt it, but just to, you know, wait for the person that deserves you, like, you know, because you are worthy, like, I don't want anyone, you know, thinking like, oh, well, he doesn't talk to me because of this, because I didn't do this with him, or what does she have that I don't have, or, you know, like, oh my god, this girl's so much prettier than me, like, that's why he's with her, like, no, he's with her because he's not able to handle your worth, like, you know, and I've had guys tell me this, like, straight up to my face, they're like, look, I would, like, love to, like, you know, be with you and, like, mess with you and stuff. He's, like, but they're, you know, but the guy is, like, he's, like, but the way that, like, you carry yourself and the way that you are, it's just, like, I can't, like, I just, I don't feel, like, worthy enough. Like, you know, which is crazy because I'm just, like, yo, like, I'm the one that's standing here wanting you and now you don't want me after you went through this whole thing of you acting like you want me. And maybe they did want me, you know, maybe a guy does want you and whatever and he's like trying his hardest or whatever and you're not you know you're not knocking your walls down for him or anything but that's the thing like a true man is going to i'm not saying like i'm not saying like use that keep using that as your excuse because people are going to get tired and they're going to leave like they're not going to care anymore like, i'm like yo i freaking tried and like it does not work um that kind of thing but i just hope at the end of the day you know your worth and you know that you know you allow, you accept what you allow. And if you don't want to accept something, you're not going to allow it. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you want it, let it happen. You know what I'm saying? If you don't, then it's a lesson to be learned and, and all that great, great stuff. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time.